Hi, it's me. Um, my dumb stupid audio thing keeps, uh, well the thing I use to download songs keeps only downloading parts of the songs. So, here we are. Um, I guess we'll have a bit more time to chat then, uh, don't we? Um, hi. Uh, if you notice me looking a lot to the top, uh, left, that is because, uh, for this game, you know, it's one of those older games where they only have the full screen option, so I had to uh, set it up so that my TV, which uh, is off to the left of me, um, <clears throat> uh, has the uh, 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 use it as a second monitor so I can have uh, chat up and OBS without, you know, having to completely exit the game in order to access those. So you know there's that. But yeah, um, I hope you all are having a nice Friday. Um, it's been a hot minute. Uh, not a whole lot has happened the past few days since Wednesday. Well yesterday, well since, uh, Tuesday rather. Um, yesterday I tried to go get blood work done but then I realized it said you have to be fasting. So, uh, I didn't get the blood work done yesterday, so we kind of just went around for no reason. And Wednesday, I uh, talked with the workforce people about stuff and things and such. And about, like, what, what it potentially will be next for me. So that's something that's, that'll be interesting. Also, if you've noticed, the mic quality has changed because I did get, uh, the what's it called the the the, the 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 cover the pop filter cover thingy for the, for the microphone so I put it closer to my face it is now uh, a lot closer to my face than it was before <clears throat> so yeah uh, other than that uh, since I couldn't get the blood work done yesterday I got it done today and unfortunately because I guess my health is just really really bad uh, lately, uh, I ended up nearly passing out and, um, getting sick, so they, they had to put, like, ice behind my neck and, like, give me a small little thing of apple juice. That was, that was fun. By fun, I mean not at all. But, you know, whatever. They took a lot of blood out of me. Like, my, my psychiatrist is like, you need to get, uh, this blood work done. And then the lady, like, at the at the place, at the hospital, like, took out, like, a pint of blood from me. Like, good lord, that's, that's far too much. That is far too much blood from, from, from my body. That, that should not be coming out of my body, for sure. Yeah, I'm fine. Uh, I was a little bit, I was, I was still a little bit dizzy afterwards. But, I'm um, doing okay now. Uh, I think. As, as okay as I can be, I guess. Really? Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. <clears throat> That's good. But yeah, I, I usually get at least slightly lightheaded when I do um when I do the uh blood work. But it, it's, it's never been this bad before. Um like it's never been so bad that I almost felt like I was actually going to pass out or something. So that's that's new. That's new and exciting, I guess. But yeah. So today we're gonna we're gonna be playing some uh little little game called Sam and Max Hit the Road. I never played this game before. I never had it as a kid or anything. Um, I haven't seen much of it. I mean, it's not a very long game from what I know, but I haven't seen a whole lot of it anyhow. <clears throat> the parts I have seen are just like from small clip compilations. Of various other Sam and Max things. Hang on. Hang on. I got stuff in my eyes. So yeah, uh... So we'll be playing... So I, want, I wanted to try this game because the other games I've sort of seen the majority of the stuff there. And this game was like $6. $6 on Steam. So I was like, yeah sure, why not? Yeah, now we're gonna be playing. So, so let's let's get right into it, shall we? Uh, 
please ignore the fact that, uh, wait, hang on, actually, hang on, actually. Actually, I don't think it's up yet. Alright, let's pull it up then. Uh, nope. Friends? Friends? Oh my god. We've only gone out together three times, and already you're telling Hang me on. you just want to be friends. Hang on. Everything's going badly. You never gave me a Everything's going badly. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on, we almost got it. Just let me... That was a lot louder than I was expecting it to be, that's for sure. But yeah, uh... Just don't, don't worry about... Don't worry about the task manager or, or anything else. Don't worry about that. Uh, hang on, let me see. I think... Yeah, that's probably good. That's probably good enough. There. Okay, let's try that. Try it once more with feeling. There it is. Friends. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. Sorry, it's a little quiet. Not that I don't like you, it's just that bell. You're too nice a guy, I guess. I think I'd rather go out with someone more bit unpredictable. Thankfully there are subtitles. All just the sound. She's still tied up. Just gonna point that out. She's still tied up. Damn, Max, hit the road. Yeah, I'm sorry about the the weird volume settings. I'll, I'll, I'll change it soon enough. I uh, just want to make sure we get through this first part, like the the beginning part first, just just so that it's uh, there. I literally cannot take my cursor out of the, the the screen to go the other monitor right now, which is unfortunate. So yeah, you're gonna have to enjoy very low volume stuff. And I was I didn't realize until just now that. My fan is really picking up on the on the uh, thing, which is great. I hate that. Yeah, this is our first. So this is Sam and Max's uh, first first game. Oh goodness, allergies. Yeah, first game after being a comic series, as far as I know. This How's my aim? Put one hundred Star Wars. Oh my god. This certainly is a game. Oh 
Wait, are, are the credits done? Okay, the credits are done. We're good. We're good. We're in. Well, that was a pleasantly understated credit sequence. I enjoyed the cheesy retro ambiance. What the hell are you talking about, Max? Sam, either termites are burrowing through my skull, or one of us is taking them. Oops. Oh, yeah. Oops. Forgot to get rid of that. Where should I put this so it doesn't hurt anyone we know or care about? Out the window, Sam. There's nothing but strangers out there. Well. I hope there was nobody on that bus. Nobody we know is decent. Bye-bye. City courier out on the street. Ooh, smells like a fiercely thickening plot. And we're in it. We're in it. Ooh. That's Sam's hand. Uh, anyways, uh, hang on. So let me just. Okay, so, uh, let me just. Please ignore this. I just need to make sure the volume levels are nice and good. Get out of here. All right, back to the game. Okay, we're in it now. Wait, hang on, I actually just realized I have to change the god dang. Just changed my own settings, my filters. Uh, do 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 do. My suppression. on seriously it's really just like not going to let me do this without at least some background noise huh Let's try this instead Okay, that's a bit but that's a bit a bit better. Hang on. Uh uh Okay. I, I I think I think we're mostly okay. Yeah, I think we're mostly good. Okay. Yeah, we're good. Okay, back once again back to the back to the fun crime fighting adventures. Um Alright. So uh we're in it now. So this is this is video games. Uh, so we got uh, this is a point and click adventure game. I don't I've never point and click adventure games not really weren't really my thing as a kid. So um, I don't really like I don't really know exactly how most of these things go. But we got um, eyeball, fist, mouth, wheeze, uh, exit box, and max. Max is also an option. It's my little buddy, ready for action. Oh, I guess we can just like move that around. Okay, we can just move them around in the box. It's Max. Shoot, dude, that sure is Max. What if I want to? What if I want to? I was going this to say. No time for chit chat. I was going to say, what if I want to fist Max? But that's a very, very bad way of saying it. So. Uh, all right, board. I can't use these things together. Oh, well then. What if I want to? I'm assuming this is talk. What if I want to talk to Max? He got to say for me. Uh, question mark, exclamation point, rubber ducky, hand. So, uh, 
Okay, the important part about my new setup is that the microphone is partly obscuring like the bottom of my screen. So I gotta be careful about that. Uh, I guess question mark. Confused as I am. More so. Cool. Well, what about I'm excited. Point? Who isn't? Thanks. What does Robert Duck do? My mind is a swirling miasma of scintillating thoughts and turgid ideas. Miasma? Today we got some kiwi strawberry water. Fun stuff. Well, that's all. Oh, no, that- okay. There was one more, though. I saw- I saw a max icon there. Oh no, I guess not. I, I guess it disappeared? I don't know. Never mind. Uh, what what else do we got? What's this? What's this? Okay, this is how you move. Okay. Um. What if we like use this? This is no time for chit chat. This is no time for chit chat. What about the dark board? Oh, uh, oh, okay. Nice. TV. I can't pick that up. What about Max? No. Uh, what about this type? Oh, there's more! There's more over here! Oh my god, there's more! Yo! Sandwich! Me, me, me! Okay. What's this? What in, what the heck is this? Let's go back in the box. Alright, let's... What, what can we look at? I can't tell if that's on Max or not. Yeah, Max, Max, get over here. Yeah, it was on Max, okay. Um... Shoot. I guess there's nothing else here. Uh. It's Max. How do I get regular hand? I want regular hand. Can I get regular hand? Is that allowed? Why did Maz? And Zan. <sighs> oh. Joe, you want a piece of me, huh? Well, take a piece of this. Brutal. But very true to life. What objective? Your old man. Oh, okay. Nice smiley face. I really respect Flint's business acumen. Please, Sam, don't use the word acumen again. I don't even know what acumen means. Hello, Detective Paper? You in there? Gratuitous acts of senseless violence are my forte. Bye bye. You're such an adorable urchin, Max. Uh, well then. Big old fan there. We don't go upstairs. Why don't we Not go upstairs? Accident. What, what accident? What accident? Oh, no, I'm worried. Oh, boy. So, fun, fun fact about this game. Uh, Sam is this voiced is by... This is a completely unusable thingamabob. Okay, but how do I... How do I not have... I just want to walk. Can I just walk? I can't pick that up. Can I just can I just go down the stairs, please? I can't use these things together. I have no idea how to open up the menu. If there is a menu. Okay. So you put you just put it back in and then you can you can go. That is a cat alright. Flailed office space available. Vehicles will be stolen. No way. That is a blood stain? Uh 
Anywho. Ah, not what I wanted to look at. Oh, it's a cute little hypercephalic kitten. Hyper what? He's adorable. Let's take him home and put tape on his feet. No, Max, we're not doing that. Vehicles will be stolen. No way. Can't look at that. Bosco's. Bosco's guns, liquor, baby needs. That's the car. I love this car. You're a sick puppy, Sam. <laughs> really bad food. Really bad food. Somebody's been ripping off the U.S. Postal Service. That sucks. Just a bunch of intoxicated pigeons. Oh, they're drinking. Okay. Um. Hmm. I guess. What you got in here, hey, Bosco? I don't think Mr. Bosco is voluntarily giving away his money. Oh, I'm real terrified. A dog and a rabbit. Ooh, scary. Max, the smart-ass kid doesn't think we're scary. What do you think about that? The Bosco is different in this game. That's telling him, little buddy. I think that punk learned a valuable lesson, Sam. Me too, Max. I didn't realize that the lower lip could stretch completely over the head. Good I'm God nice. almighty. They are just absolutely insane. Let's go for a drive. Yeah, what I was going to say was that uh, Sam is voiced by in this game by Phil Farmer, who is the voice of Goofy, and has been for a good long while. Hi there. Where are we going, I wonder? I guess we're going to Maine. Tom Nation and Blimey, the idea. So, now what do we do? Now? Now we get in the bus and look for him, you idiot. What are I these- that, yeah. What are these accents? Good lord, they are uh. terrible. Get out of Mr. Bumpus' way, ye partially clad varmints. Who is that? I don't know, but if it weren't for the carefree innocence of this carnival, I'd be breaking his kneecaps. You're a demonic little imp, Max. Well, here we are at the circus. Here we are at SeaWorld. All of Oddities. All of Oddities. That was this one. Cushman Brothers Shows. Weird. Creepy. Thanks. Stop. All right. What do you want? Stop. Why, sir? Hey, what's the hold up? Sorry, boys, we are closed. I can't let you in. Insurance reasons, you know. I see. Don't you know who we are? I could not care less. Great. Don't you know who we are? I could not care less. Let us in, holy old breath. Holy old? Let us in, holy old breath. Nope. What does the duck I do? I want a corn dog. You'd better have a better reason than that if you expect me to let you in. Alright, who's the blonde guy? Who are those misanthropes at the gate? Which misanthropes? The short one with the bad hairpiece, and the tall one with the dark flinty eyes. Hey, I just work here. Anything else? Great. I'll be back. I can hardly wait. Yeah, I don't know if I can do anything with any of this stuff. Alright, let's... Sir, I'm leaving. Use you. Yeah. It's my little buddy, ready for action. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Okay. Let's get out of here. Um. What the heck is. 
That is not, that is not where New York City is. That is not where New York City is at all. Excuse you. Can we go this way? No, we can't. Down this, oh wait, there's a cat there. Hello. Hang on, hang on. Look, it's yet another cat. A nice, round, chubby cat. Looks like he got caught in a threshing machine. That's unfortunate. Um. Is there anything over here? No. Can I talk to any of these animals? Hey there, little fella. You talking to me? Yeah. Maybe. Are you a cleverly disguised bonded city courier? Maybe. Are you the freelance police? Yes. Yes, but don't go blabbing into everybody. <laughs> I think he's kind of cute, Sam. Can I make a tennis racket out of him? No, Max. Maybe later, Max. Right now, we've got a message from the commissioner to collect. Oh, yeah, right. You good? Sorry, guys. I swallowed your orders for safekeeping. But now I can't seem to hock them back up. How do we get you to hock them back up? Maybe we grab him? I won't pick that kitten up. I don't know where he's been. No. Alright, he doesn't want to touch him. I don't indiscriminately use people, except Max. Well, what if we use Max on this? I just this? love to turn this guy inside out. Oh. Ooh, that gives me an idea. Cool, I guess. According to these orders, something bizarre is happening at the carnival. Well, I guess I went to the I carnival a little early. Boy. Maybe we should check it out when we've got nothing better to do, like guinea time. Oh, well, back to the carnival we go. Can can we can we go inside the game? Game? I would like to go inside the car. Oh, I, I gotta use the interact thing, don't I? Cool. In you go, boys. All right. All right. Yeah, that's, that is most definitely not at all where New York City is. New York City would be like more here-ish. This is like Carolinas, honestly. Da, da, ba, da, da, da. Um. Dude. Hey, what's the hold up? Sorry, boys, we are closed. I can't let you in. Insurance reasons, you know. Who are those misanthropes at the gate? Which misanthropes? The short one with the bad hair piece and the It is a darn shame that I can't skip uh the, the repeat dialogue. Hey, just work here. Anything else? I'll be back. I can hardly wait. Okay, uh maybe it's our orders from the commissioner telling us to hightail it down to the carnival. Maybe give this to him? Check mm. this out, Jack. We're the freelance police. Here's our authorization to be here. We got a warrant, I guess. Now let us in before we replace you with a cheap renewable fuel source. Let me run this by the boss. Well, guess it's gone. Uh, I guess you can go in. Thank be you. Careful. Cannibals can be dangerous to your health. <laughs> I honestly thought he said, uh, cannibals for a second there. That was needlessly cryptic. I'd be peeing my pants if I wore any. Everything seems to be in order mm. here. Sam, oh, look over there. uh, Rage 2018. Okay, Thank you for following. Without consulting me. Well, I tried talking to you, but you were off wallowing in your own self-pity. Yeah, but it's them. I see. They're Hi, conjoined twins. I'm Chef Cushman, and this is my brother Burl. Welcome to our carnival. Hello. What's left of it? I'm Sam. He's Max. We savagely protect the rights of innocence. 
Savagely. Even cruelly twisted ones such as yourself. Selves. Whatever. Well, you sound like just the guys to solve our little problem. Walk this way. Talk this way. Walk this way. See this melted block of ice? Yes. How could we miss it? This used to be our main attraction. Your main attraction was a block of ice? Don't be dense. Our main attraction was a genuine, authentic, real life Bigfoot. Wow. On ice. On ice. Hey, let me get this straight. You want us to the musical on all ice? Over the country looking for a soggy Bigfoot? I've never been traipsing before. Does it hurt? No. But Bruno must be returned to us. But Bruno Mars must be returned to us. He's a brutish, ignorant beast with no sense of right or wrong. So Max. Hey, who isn't? Besides, he's kidnapped our second main attraction. Is that the block of ice? No, it's Trixie the giraffe neck girl from Scranton. Oh, she Scranton. disappeared at the same time Bruno did. We can only assume that the monster took her when he made his escape. I guess Max and I could search for your missing freaks, but we'll need free run of the carnival to look for clues. Yeah, and free corn dogs, so we can uke all over ourselves. Please don't. No problem. Here's an all-day free pass. Leave everything to us, and we'll have those abominations of nature back in your protective care before you can read the Koran. Didn't he fight Godzilla? Nope, that's... nope, nope. Sorry, that's... that's incorrect. Alright. Can we pick up this very obvious clue? This is a completely unusable thingamabob. That's it. Yeah. That was interaction. Let's grab it. Cool, so we got some hair. It's a mange ridden tuft of Bruno's Sasquatch hair. I think it would make a swell toupee for balding computer programmers. That'd be stupid, sure Max. Could. It's my little buddy, ready for action. Hey. Okay. What else we got around here? How Kafka esque. Interesting. Hello. He's a nice guy, but sort of a drip. He looks delicious. Max, what are you doing? It's a melted ice block. I guess we can talk to them and see if they have anything else to say. What else you got? Uh, which one do I talk to? Me! Me! Him! Him! Okay. Um, so... Is there anything else you can tell us about your escaped Bigfoot? Well... He's a Bigfoot. He's escaped. He's a menace to society. What more could you possibly need to know? He's right, Sam. I don't think my colossal head could retain any more knowledge. Good. What can you tell us about Trixie? She's a very caring, sensitive young woman. Mm. You care about that kind of stuff. She used to sing folk songs to the other freaks in her trailer. You ever heard a Scrantonese folk song? No. I'm sorry. You don't want to. Oh, there was one. They got thing. folk songs in Scranton. She likes her men like the Statue of Liberty. Green and rusty. Tall and dense. I see. I like my coffee just like my men. Green. Uh. Yeah, Scranton is a place in Pennsylvania. If you've never watched The Office before, the place in uh, Pennsylvania is. Uh, I think there's probably like a college there, but it's actually like it's probably fairly close to the northern border So it's like not too too far from uh, where I live uh, Who are those actually. guys we bumped into out by the gate? Uh, what guys? One was a short guy with big hair The other one was a tall guy with big hands Oh, you must be talking about internationally renowned recording star Conroy Bumpus and his assistant Lee Harvey. Bumpus? Who's Conroy Bumpus? Bumpus. He's a loon. Insane. And the country and western singer, The Boot. He actually wanted to buy Bruno and Trixie from us. Boy, was he steam when he found out that I'm sorry you were going to buy a human? I'll bet life is an unending torment for you guys. Actually, it's not so bad. Speak for yourself. Nike, Nikes. Where do you buy your clothes, anyway? These aren't clothes. 
Our skin is naturally green and vinyl-like. What Lord. do you mean? He's buck naked. So are you. Yeah, but I'm cute and marketable. What do you mean you're butt naked? Well, it's back to the Bigfoot hunt. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. We're leaving. We're leaving. Goodbye. Oh, there's Trixie's trailer. Da da ba da 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 da. I'd better do something about that padlock first. Oh, there's a padlock on it. Okay. Wacko rat. <laughs> Way to count how many times you <laughs> does it. Wait. Okay, hit 20. Hit 20 to win. Hit. Hit. I don't think I'm gonna hit 20. Oh boy. Okay, I got this. 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 Yeah! I got 20. He's fine. I do like how Sam's just like sticking his tongue out. That's that's kind of cute. Yeah, just just whack a rat something. or whack Max. What the heck did I win? What did you? Oh, oh, it's in the thing there. All right. No, it's not. God dang it! I don't know how to get out of this. Tilt. I didn't win. Yeah, you sure didn't. Get tilted. Alright, what did I get? The heck is this? What is this? Whoa. You good there, mouse? Hey, this crummy prize doesn't come with any light bulb. It's a flashlight? God dang it. Alright, let's keep on going. Cone of tragedy. Hello. Excuse us. We need some help, and although you seem dangerously unequipped brain-wise, we've come to you for advice. Huh? Uh, can you tell us about this Me cone? Me and my partner want to ride the cone of tragedy. That's right. We've lost our will to live. I'm not supposed to, but what the heck? Sorry? You two look like a couple of caring, non-litigious mammals. Strap yourselves in, and I'll turn on the cone. Cool. Uh, what's, what's this right do? Oh! Yeah, don't seem safe. You're fine. He's fine. See, he's fine. What a ride. Ooh, I feel tragically empty. Me too. It's as though an integral part of my essence has been ripped from my being. Wow. Let's do it again. Maybe later, chum. Hey, what happened to my carefully collected box of useless Oh, god junk? dang it. I lost my items. Will you help me? Depends. What do you want? What the heck did you do to my Where items? My cool junk go? It must have fallen out of your coat while you were on the ride. Oh, God dang it! Here's a claim ticket. Take it to the lost and found. Where's the lost and found? I'll ask you a bit more. Will you help me? Depends. What do you want? Can you tell what me you about, about Bigfoot? Bruno, the Bigfoot? Who wants to know? We're the freelance police, and we're in a race against time. And we're barefoot. 
There are. All I know about Bruno is what the Cushmans tell me. Well, that was useless. Great. You might want to try the Tunnel of Love, though. Pardon? Rumor has it that one of Bruno's buddies hangs out in there. Oh, let's go, Sam. Oh, hush. Do you have any idea what happened to Trixie? Trixie, the giraffe girl from Scranton? No, Trixie, the talkative poodle. She's my best customer. She used to ride the cone of tragedy for hours on end. I loved the way her neck used to whip back and forth when I cranked it up to full speed. That's terrifying. Your is a credit to your profession. That's terrifying. Thanks. Anywho. Do you guys all go to the same tattoo parlor or what? Actually, these aren't tattoos. It's my natural skin. I hate this. I hate this place. Whoa, you're a big boy. And that's why I sit down all the time. Whoa, you go, big guy. Bye. It's been swell. Alright, well now we gotta go find the lost and found. I don't even know where that could possibly be. Oh, there it is. Hey, lost and found. Cripes on toast. Nothing personal, but you're the single ugliest thing we've ever seen. Oh. Well, there was that computer game developers conference. Have you lost something? I lost a whole bunch of neat junk. You must have been gifted with psychic powers to make up your obvious physical shortcomings. God dang. Bad deal. Have you got a claim ticket? Sure. Wait here while I search through the back room. Where the heck is the god dang back? Okay. Collected off the Kono tragedy today. It's all yours. I feel whole again. What? What is this? It's a powerful refrigerator magnet that says World of Fish on its side. I wonder how that got in there. Oh. We unlocked a new area. I guess. Cool. Anyways, where's the tunnel of love? Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. Wait. Hey, Max. What? Can you ring that bell? Sure. You're my hero, little buddy. Yay! Alright. Anywho. So, I... Okay, the Tunnel of Love is over this way. Looks like. That looks like a Cupid, so... Uh, I don't know why there's a demon here. Over... What's over here? What's this? Nothing? Oh, that's... Okay, that literally just leads us back here. I didn't realize that was an area we can go to. Or not? We cannot go- why can we not go back there? Why can't we go, go back there? What's happening? I can't pick that up. Not what I wanted to do. Alright, we gotta go all the way back. I can't pick that up. I'm going to lose my goddamn mind. Okay, go all the way back around. Okay, back here to the Tunnel of Love. How long have we been going for? Oh my god, we've been going for 45 minutes. How did that even happen? Alright. Yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. Tunnel of Love. In there. Want to ride the tunnel of love? Yippee! All right, so we're looking for Bruno's friend. Off we go. Um. The heck? Of that 
Evelyn Morrison classic, Revenge of the Gill Guy. You really should get out of here, Sam. Shut up. Okay, there's something going on here. I don't know what to do about that, but there's something going on here. Oh, wait, am I supposed to combine these? It fits perfectly. It's a nifty flashlight equipped with a black light. Neat. Hang on, hang on, hang on. No, no, no. Go back. I don't even know what... Okay, how... God dang it. I don't know how to fix that. That sucks. How do I fix that? I gotta go back. Oh. Well, that was fun. My little body's covered with swan pimples. What? Oh, it's great. We're leaving. We're leaving. We're going to the fish place now. How do I... How do I get out of here? Alright, cool. Let's go to the fish place. I don't know what to do about... Yeah. This is a completely unusable thingamabob. I can't use these... Alright. Uh bu 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 Max, where are you going? Where are you going, bud? Fish feed. World of fish. That's a big old honker. I hear a distant rumbling. You should have thought of that before we left. Hmm. Oh, helicopter. Oh god, here it comes. That looks 3D. I don't don't know what that's about. What a hunk of fillet. I'm naming it Bubbles. Thanks, Max. It's a big fish net. You really just interrupt the entirety of goddamn plot. Good. That's a large fiberglass fish. Excuse us, sir. What's going on here? What's going on? <laughs> I'll tell you what's going on. I'm risking pneumonia standing in this creek. That's what's going on. What's the deal with that helicopter? That helicopter is the bane of my existence. Every time I catch enough fish to fill a net, the helicopter swoops down and carries the fish to the Ball of Twine Diner in Central Dis, Minnesota. Central Dis. How sad. I know. It's like being stuck in a Norman Mailer novel. What? What do you know about Bigfoots? My great aunt Lois married a Bigfoot. He used to hey, share with Grandma Phyllis's upholstery. Oh, oh my God! Oh my God! My own grandmother was named Phyllis. Oh my God! What the heck? Oh my God! That was weird. Have you seen Conroy Bumpus? No, I try not to listen to country music. When I do, I usually have an uncontrollable desire to drink a lot of beer and do illegal things to farm animals. You I have, I have many concerns. I'm just gonna go now. I'm gonna go now. Is there anything over this way or what's over here? Nothing. 
All right. Well, I guess we're going to the twine restaurant. Uh, interact. Car. And you go, boys. World's largest ball of twine. Well, it certainly is a large ball of twine, huh? The world's largest ball of twine. I get worried about Max walking, wandering off like a like a mother. Only cat heaven. How long do you suppose it took them to wind this immense ball of twine? More importantly, how did they get it to stop rolling once it was all wound? Oh, this way. Oh my god, he moves so, so slow. Oh, that's 3D, alright. It's a tram launch leading to the Ball of Twine restaurant, and this sign points to the Twine Museum. This is a completely unusable thingamabob. You don't know that. You don't, you don't know that. Take a leg, Max. Here he comes. Here he comes. <laughs> you can't even see him over in the window. You can just see his ears. I really hope this thing has like some sort of hey, autosave feature. I would hate to go have to go through all this again. That's one long loose end. Too bad we can't reach it from this side of the deck. You always need a large piece of string in games like this. Hmm. That is true. Okay, hang on. Let me just... Sam and Max hit the road controls. Okay, hang on. There's a Manuel. Got ourselves- I found myself a Manuel on the Googles. Alright. Okay, so. Uh, do 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 Enter to start. Okay, so we got keyboard and cursor controls. Normal face. W to walk to, use to look, to use, uh, L to look at, O if there's an object, I, eyeball, toggle inventory, I on and off with I, cycle through the inventory with D, A to cycle backwards, S, end of, end of inventory, Z is start. Flip in and out of film the war mode. B? What the heck? What the heck? <laughs> what? Oh, this is very silly. Flip game in and out of dummy verb mode where verb cursors have names under them. Uh, quits mini games. Is Q. You just cursor to talk to. Pick up. How do I save the game? Okay, F F1 and F. Five are saving and loading. Okay, good, 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 good. And then pausing is spacebar. Okay. Yeah, this is very important. Uh. Yeah, F1. I guess save save the game. I think I saved it. I pressed F1, so. All right, let's get out of here then. No, I don't want to use Max. Can't use these things together. Near that, I might have to press F5 to save. I don't know. Okay, let's save there. Oh! Oh, there it is. Okay, F. There we go. Save. 
Okay, there's auto saves. Cool, cool, cool. That's really good. All right, cancel. Um, options. Both speech and subtitle. Subtitle speed sixty. Mute all. Okay. Out. Okay, resume. Resume. All right, let's keep on going. Ugh. Actually, hang on. I um. I gotta go get my my dinner. I got pizzas, so let me just let's. Oh my god! So let's uh pause it for right now. Yeah, I'll I'll be right 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 back. Um. Yeah, I'll, I'll be back real soon. I just gotta go get my pizzas and I'll bring them up here and eat them all playing. <laughs> I'm also probably not gonna go for too much longer because I wanna make sure that uh, if anybody happens to be streaming Deltarune 2, I gotta, I wanna find, I wanna see them st stream it. Yeah, listen to some fun, fun funky music while, while, uh, while I get some dinner. Here be. Back. I got one and a half little pizzas. Mmm. Delicious. Anywho. Get back to the game. Look at my cursor. There's my cursor. Okay. Mmm. Alright, so, who the heck are you? What's your deal, Ishmael? You work here? Yep, have been for 40 years. Mm. So how can I help you? Uh, twine. This ball isn't really made from a continuous piece of twine, is it? Uh, yep, it's the longest piece of twine in the world by 92 yards. That's a lot of yards. But the fish. With all the fish guts flying past the window. Those are leftovers from our last fish delivery. Our famous rotating restaurant has fresh fish flown in every day from the world of fish in Mosquitoville, Missouri. Mosquitoville. You haven't seen an eight foot tall woodland creature answering to the name of Bruno around here, have you? Are you talking about Bruno the Bigfoot? Yeah. He and a bunch of other big boots helped build the ball of time. I'm sorry. Fifty-six. Quite the stories I could tell. No. Mm -hmm. I've heard enough stories today. Have you seen Bruno recently? I haven't seen Bruno in thirty or so years. Is he in trouble? That depends on your definition. Maybe. I like to use the one that involves spiny echidnae. 
Nothing? Um. Has Conroy Bumpus passed through here? Who is that? He's a country western star gone berserk with power. Is that what you call him? I don't know him if I saw him. I don't get out much. Max, no. Stop that. How'd you get this job anyway? I clawed my way to the top, trampling those foolish enough to get in my way. Cool. Stop staring at me. I can't help it. It's places like this that make me wish I were Canadian. Well, they've got one of these too, but half of it's French. What? Okay, we're leaving. That'll be all for now. What's this uh, payment you got? Fun facts about the world's largest ball of twine. If laid out from end to end, the ball would stretch from here to the far side of Jupiter. Also, scientists theorize that by 2053, the sheer weight of the ball will push the Earth out of its orbit, uh -huh. propelling our planet on a collision course with the sun. Good thing my life expectancy is only six years. Way to take the short view, little buddy. Max, how old are you? That's terrifying. Max this. It's a one two hundred thousand scale model of the actual ball of twine. Oh. And it's only one two hundred thousand as stupid as the actual ball of twine. That is twine. According to the plaque, this is a shaving from the first foot of the ball of twine. I didn't know it was old enough to shave. <laughs> well, it's from the 50s, I would hope so. It's my little buddy, ready for action. No, don't grab that. That's it? Really it? How the heck do we get to the- I can't pick that up. I can't believe Max has been dead for over 20 years. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh good lord. Wait, what, what was this one? Hey, this means we can ride free all day. Oh yeah. Does it say anything about corn dog, Sam? Sorry, little buddy. It's a powerful refrigerator magnet that says World of Fish on its side. Okay, powerful refrigerator magnet. Mm -hmm. All right. I would say maybe I could use the magnet with the uh on the tall love ride, but I'm already using the flashlight, so I don't know if that'll work. Would Would you like to leave the building? Okay. That back there. Then leave the building. Thank you, Sam. Okay, I think there was... Wait, well, actually, no, this was the last place that we unlocked. Hmm. What happens if I go to a burger joint? Nuckies. What in the world is this Nuckies? If Max spontaneously grew antlers, he still wouldn't be this ugly. Hmm. Snuckies. It's my little buddy, ready for action. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. That was a convenience store. <laughs> they got a little thing there. Wait, hang on, I saw something out there. Uh. I'd ride this fiendish quarter grabber, but my lumbago's acting up. Your what? Your what? Okay, can I grab this? Cool. I don't know what to do with that. Uh, it's one of those jumbo size all you can drink Snuckies cups. Cool. It's almost as big as my head. Wow. Anywho. Thanks 
they got grenades here. Hello. I'm almost done with my pizza. Here? Don't I wish? I'd have to go to Snucky you for another six years before I could run this place. Snucky you. About me, what can I do for you? They are Bigfoot. Do you know anything about Bigfoots? Only what I read in the weekly International Evening Inquirer Star. Anything else? Great. Snucky you. That sounds exciting. Or at least distracting. Oh, it is. Snucky you is where all Snucky's employees are sent to learn the ins, the outs, the ups, the downs, the overs, and the unders of the amazing gastronomical and cultural phenomenon that is Snucky's. Fascinating. No, it's not. <laughs> Humor him. At Snucky You, we're given intensive courses in patty pounding, choosing the right button for soft drinks, and the all-important pickle jar opening. I had no idea you were so rigorously trained. This is hey, like a I can open any jar gas station, station, right? Cool. No, it's not. Now, how can I put all that Snucky You training to use for you? Um. Are you sure Snucky You's not in the Bowl Coalition? Positive. Now, what can I do for you? Is there anything else you'd like to tell us? And try to keep Snucky you out of it. Sorry, I can't think of a thing. Maybe if you were more specific? Uh... Nothing. You have no idea how often I hear that. Let's talk to this guy, I guess. What's your story, Morning Glory? Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. I gotta go to the bathroom. What? Sharing this experience with you has reminded me. I want Twinklies! More Twinklies! What? Uh... I don't think he'd want that. Well, maybe I could get a fountain drink, Sam? God. Everything about that? It's a box of pecan flavored candies. Hmm. Genuine Native American drums, manufactured by genuine Native Koreans. Hmm. That don't seem right. Macalopes, the bastard pets of Piltdown Man. Who the heck is Piltdown Man? A shelf full of Snucky's crap. And what is this shelf, boys? It's a carousel of bootleg Sam and Max portable car bomb games. Interesting. It's an official Snucky's fly swatter. You with me? It's a large, sturdy Snucky's. There's not a lot to do here. Okay, we are leaving the Snucky's. Really have to interact with it first, huh? Okay. So, what is this one? What's this one in the Mexico area? What's this? Wait, what? What do I? What? Oh. What the heck is? What? What am- what am- what? Alright, um... Interesting. Oh, let's go back to the fish place. Maybe... I don't know. I doubt this guy can give us much more information, but, you know. It's a powerful refrigerator magnet. 
I don't think he'd want that. How about here? Is this be magnetic? Use these things together. Um. Haven't any luck? I haven't had any luck since the day I was born. He's in crackers, dude. You must really love fish. Actually, I'm allergic to them. Then why do you work here? <sighs> because I'm more allergic to poverty. Fair enough. I love all your movies, especially <laughs> the early funny ones. What are you talking about? Sorry, I must have confused you with someone else. What? No, I don't. Don't move. What? Okay. Let's hey, get in there. Climbing this fish. After you. Okay. <sighs> yep, I'm already stuck. Cool. And this is why I don't play adventure games often. I'm gonna go try to do a thing through the tunnel. Back we go! <laughs> Wanna ride the Tunnel of Love again? Why not? Why the heck not? Let's do it. Do, 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 do. Okay. Corn dogs? That's a lot of corn dogs, I gotta say. What the heck do I do with this? I like uh maybe magnet? I don't I don't know. I can't use these things together. God dang it. I can't pick that up from here. Max. That's probably a good idea. I should have tried it sooner. Wait. I mean, is it actually a good idea or Okay, I guess we'll go on it once more with feeling. I think we're supposed to do something in there, Sam. Nah. Nah. Alright, in you go. Back in. Let's ride the TOL again. TOL? You insist? All right, I'm gonna try to throw throw Max at the at the thing. See if that works. All right, Max. God damn it! God damn it! God damn it! Shoot! 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 shoot. Okay. Uh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Wait, wait, wait. Uh. It's my little buddy. Ready. Son of a. That, that, that's, pro that's probably a good idea. I should have tried it sooner. I hate this. <sighs> okay. I can't skip this. So. Please stop looking at me, Sam. It's making me uncomfortable. Fourth time's the charm. I'm beginning to get frustrated. I'm sure there's something there. Me too. I am also beginning to get frustrated. Back. Back in. 
Let's ride the TOL again. You insist? All right. First of all, gotta turn the light on. Press the inventory button. That back. Then grab Max. I'm gonna lose my goddamn mind. Oh, he's dead. What are you doing, Max? This is a completely unusable thingamabob. No, I don't want to use Max. This is a completely unusable thingamabob. I can't pick that up. No, really. I can't pick that up. I can't pick that up. Alright, I guess we're just gonna go back this way then. That looks like a usable door. I can't walk through this door. It's not real. Well, that sucks. The heck am I supposed to do then? What the heck am I supposed to do? It's a large, sturdy Snucky's cup. I grab some water. What's what is happening? I can't use these things together. I can't talk to that. What do you mean you can't talk to that? That's Max! <laughs> I can't talk to that. Sir, that's just Max. What do you mean you can't talk to that? Okay, let's look at it, I guess. Just another random acts of violence. Just another random acts of violence. Get off of there, Max. Why? Check this out. I'll never shave again. Oh. You never did. I see. It's my little buddy, ready for action. How was I supposed to know? Whatever. <laughs> Screw it. In you go, boys. Who the heck are you? What the heck is this? What is all this here? What's this? Can I interact with that? God damn it, Max. There. That should get things running again. You, the sir. Who are you? What's your deal? Who are you? Ishmael. I'm Doug, the Mole Man. Who are you? I'm Sam. He's Max. We fight crime. And we like long walks along the beach. Ooh, what uh. for me? You seen you know Bruno? Anything about Bruno the Sasquatch? Bruno the Sasquatch? Why, the stories I could tell you. Stop him, Sam. He's gonna tell us a story. I first met Bruno 25 years ago in Saigon. Great. Glad that happened. And then there was the time we all had our taxes done by a platypus. And shut up, for God's sake, just shut up! Look, we just want to know where Bruno is now. Gee, I have no idea where he went. Maybe you should talk to my uncle. Who is your uncle? Yeah, my uncle Shavul. He's really into Bigfoots. When I was a kid, he used to tell me stories about giant Bigfoot parties, where all the Bigfoots of the world would get together and dance Bigfoot dances and... That's great, kid. Where can we find your uncle? I don't know. He great. disappeared a short time after he helped build the largest ball of twine on Earth. I think I may weep openly. Look, you two seem trustworthy. Do they? Oh, we are. Yes, you can trust us as far as we can throw you. So if you bring me some pecan-flavored candy, I'll give you my key to Trixie's trailer. I'll also tell you a big secret about how Bruno escaped. Why not tell us? All now? right. 
Because I'm hungry. Back, back to the convenience store. Cool. I think that's all for now. Fine. You can find your own way out. Back to the convenience store. Hello. Can't interact with it? Nope. Okay. Well, I guess we're going. This is a completely unusable thingamabob. I love completely unusable thingamabobs. Get out. <clears throat> Alright. Time to get some pecan candy from the Oh, skunkies. What the heck is his name? I forget already. Anywho. Alright. Some pecan. Snuckies, my bad. I mixed up some things. Alright. I gotta go to the bathroom. What's up, Max? I got some candy. Okay, sir. I don't think he'd want that. Are we are we just gonna steal it? It's a box of pecan flavored candy. We're just gonna steal it, aren't we? Are you in charge here? Don't I wish. <laughs> I'd have to go to Snucky You for another six years before I could run this place. But enough about me. What can I do for you? I'd like to buy this. Do you have any money? You mean we have to pay money for this crap? Them's the rules. Nerds. What do you mean? Like this, not anything else. I didn't even read the, that. That says something about capitalism. Nothing. You have no idea how. How are we gonna get money? God dang it! How are we gonna get money? How are we gonna get money? Yeah, I, I know. Sh shut up, Max. Screwed up. It's my little buddy. Ready I screwed up. I screwed up. Where are we gonna get money? Where are we gonna get money? Where are we gonna get money? I'm back in NYC. Doubtful, but you, n you never know. In you go, big boy. In you go, big guy. Right. Anything I can grab here? Can't pick up the rats. No. Nope. I can't pick that up. Good job. Ready for action. I have no clue what I'm supposed to do here. Where do I get money from? Can I talk to this cat? I can talk to the other cat. Can I talk to this cat? Kitty with a mangled eye. How are you today? Meow. Is that all you can say? Meow, meow. Great. I guess he just slipped through the cracks of our public school system. Here, kitty, kitty. Meow. Meow. Well, Sam, I really don't think we're going to get much out of this. You don't know. Can I talk to the birds up there at all? Speak pigeon. Oh, great. Wait. 
Where am I gonna get money? Where am I gonna get money? Where am I gonna get money? Back to the twine place in a bit. I mean, I doubt I'm gonna find anything there, but I mean, it doesn't hurt to try, I guess. Damn, where are you going? Okay, cool. some water on my nose. Hmm. So... Can we interact with anything here? Back in we go. I steal money from somewhere? I feel like I gotta steal money. sleep here and I get all the twine I can eat. Mm. So how can I help you? Good. How'd you get this job anyway? I clawed my way to the top trampling those foolish enough to get in my way. Mm. Isn't it a little environmentally unsound dumping all those excess fish guts on the ground? Maybe. Who cares? Hey, good point. Somebody does. Not them, but somebody does. What would you do if someone cut off, say, 94 yards of the ball? We'd shoot them, skin them, and sell them as jerky treats. Good to know. Is there anything else you can tell us about Bruno? I can't think of a thing that'll take less than 40 minutes to cover. Then forget it. I need my information in bite-sized packets. Sure you haven't seen Conroy Bumpus? I just don't know. It's places like this that make me wish I were Canadian. Well, they've got one of these, too, but half of it's French. That'll be all for now. Great. <laughs> this is a completely unusable thingamabob. God damn, I didn't want Max. If I'm gonna need any string in this game, it'd better be a longer piece. Probably. I can't pick that up. Now there's something you don't see every day. What the hell are you talking about, Sam? We dump our fish heads out the window all the time. I see. Now, but these are halibut. It's my little buddy. Ready? Okay. Going back to the circus, who anybody over there knows. 
Oh, Delta Ring 2 is out. Probably end this soon. Go to the circus first and see what they got. See if they know anything. Alright, uh, let's talk to you a bit more. Doesn't that hurt? A lot. I suppose there's a trick to eat. I just haven't been able to figure it out. Wonderful. Your ineptitude gives hope to all of us further down on the food chain. Is there anything else I can do for you? Did you ever talk to Bruno before he escaped? How could I? He was in a block of ice. Peace time. What do you know about Trixie? Absolutely nothing. We never talked to each other. Ever. Are you sure you don't know anything about Conroy Bumpus? He is a country singer, right? Sorry, but I don't know much about him. I'm more of a mumbo fan. Anything I'm, else? I'm wondering why this guy's voice is... why he has a uh, French accent. Good. Alright. Alright, let's talk to, to the twins again. And then I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Stop for the evening. Come back to this next Friday, probably. Uh, Alright, boys. Which one do I talk to? Me! Me! Him! Him! Nope, oh, nothing else. Well, it's back to the Bigfoot hunt. Alright, well... That sucks. Let's get that new save in! How do I make money? Yay! Alright. Now, if I open this one, then I can quit! Yay! Alright. So I'll try to be back on Tuesday with more Mario and Luigi. And, uh, I think that's really about it, to be honest. <clears throat> Not much else going on, uh... Well, yeah, Tuesday and Thursday I'll try to get a Mario and Luigi in. Then, uh, Friday will be, uh, I guess the next, the latter half of this game. Because this game isn't very long, so whatever. Anywho, that's about it. Okay, bye.